Hey guys, it's been a while since I made a fire alarm video. Well, I believe that's gonna happen today. And today I'm bringing back the garage fire alarm system test because we are in the garage. Um, yeah. So, remember the rock climbing wall here? Well, there's all the rocks, screws. But uh, there's a wire. So I'm gonna show you. So let me start off by saying, um, yeah, so got a power. This, I'll explain later what that is. Goes up to the fire alarm thing. There's no pull station hooked up, just these. But there's something that activates the system. So you got a wire going through, goes through, and I managed to fish some wire. Got through the bore, goes up to a um, fire alarm siren. I forget the model number. Um, yeah, I'm not too tall, but let me um, And then for the mount box, I, there's a hole behind the box, fishes through there, goes up, across, down through a hole to this. I haven't had this in a system test in a long time, so I have it here. Now, usually my pull station would be here because. Um, well, I'm pull station over here because it, uh, usually I had them all to my test, but it broke. So, for now, I use these echo buttons. And yes, these do activate the system. These are wireless. Um, I haven't labeled them yet, but there's this one, and there's this one. And yeah, and that has to do something with that. So if I stand back, that's the system. Now, yes, there'll be some more stuff added onto this board and all that, but for now, this is a little demo board thing for the fire alarm system. So, I'm gonna get some hearing protection on, and I'll explain about what that thing does. So, I don't know if you guys know what this is, but this is a smart plug, a Wi Fi smart plug. Now, I got all programmed through some Alexa routines. So, um, yeah, so how does it work? Well, I have a routine. Whenever any of these buttons are pressed, it will turn on this thing, which generally gets power to this, which then activates the fire alarm system. Activates the fire alarm system. And um, put that down for a second. This, usually is where the pull station is, but have this as a closed circuit because um, there's a pull station, so I had to get two wires and just wire them together. And it does work. And this also lights up during an alarm condition. But yeah, um, it's not hooked up right now. Basically, all you do is just press a button and then it takes a little seconds. When it turns green, that no, like it's activated, turns on the switch, controls, turns on that, which then turns on the fire alarms. So yep, I'm gonna get some hair protection on this time. For real, and we will get right to the test. Okay, guys, my hearing protection's on, power's connected. So, go straight to the video. But first, just want to say one thing really quick this is very loud, so turn down your volume. And if you have epilepsy, do not watch part past this video, click out of it because these flash at a high rate. And yep, yeah. so I'm gonna press one of the buttons, just so gonna turn on that. Which will set off that, which will set off these alarms. So we'll start with this one. That's like the silence or turn off button. Uh, yeah. Silence or reset button. It could also be as a drill button, for example, like this. <laughs> yeah. And now we're going to set off this button. I have to set up my uh, video that so we can see that go off, but yeah.
Hey guys, um, sorry that's a little bit of a quick video, because, um, yeah, but I am um, going to make another video about this soon, so stay tuned for that. Anyways, hope you have a good day, and stay safe.